Today we're going to be doing a what is in my beautiful Glossier gym bag. Let me get let me get a little picture. Let me get a little picture. It's kind of dirty, but um, yeah, we're going to do a what is in my gym bag because your girl is trying to get back into the gym. I've been going like a little bit here and there, but I'm trying to like get more consistent because, you know, all that good stuff. So I'm gonna show y'all like my essentials, what I bring to have just a successful gym day. You know what I mean? So yeah, let's get into it. So first things first, this is the gym bag. I freaking love it. It's so cute. It's from Glossier. My sister actually gave it to me. So I'm like, ah, she loved me for real. So first things first, um, I bring my iPad, like my electronics and stuff, because after the gym. I be sitting in my like little cafe or whatever. Second is my hygiene products, and I'm gonna give y'all like a close up too of like all this stuff, but of like what's in here. This one is my skincare and my makeup, and then this one is like my body care and stuff like that. So this is everything that I keep in my um, skincare slash makeup bag. First things first. Um, I also have my my soap in here, but I don't keep that in there. But I have like this toner from when I'm washing my face after I get done showering I'll use this toner it's, it's a cute little like travel size so I really like it and then my gym also like provides us with cotton rounds so I just bring that and then these are the two serums that I am loving at the moment these are like my go-to's uh the ordinary hyaluronic acid and niacinamide serums literally quick simple like they do what they need to do and then as you can see like i need to get some more of this this is my holy grail like this keeps my skin looking so fresh so beautiful so supple so hydrated it's the superfood air whip moisture came from you to the people definitely need to re-up on this but i keep that in there and then my makeup like just for like a quick no makeup makeup routine I have my Glossier Play. This is like a highlight um, type of thing that I put like just on my skin. And then some concealer that I've been using. Um, I go back and forth between this one and the Milk Makeup one. And just some mascara, nothing crazy. And then my freaking uh, Holy Grail. I actually just started using this product. Um, and I freaking love it. It's the Merit Blush. Like, at first, I was using the Glossier one, but I just don't like the application. So, this one is just, like, way better application. I love it so much. And then I have, like, my eyebrow brush. And then, I don't even know where my eyebrow gel is, but that's, like, basically everything. And then my beauty blender. So, that's everything that I have in, like, my skincare makeup section. And then moving on to body care. So I have this little like travel size pastel soap. I freaking love this because I can just refill it and it's like perfectly uh, fits in my bag. And then I have my uh, deodorant. Also, sorry if I'm sniffling y'all. Like it's starting to get really cold in New York. So yeah, just, just bear with me. But I have this deodorant. This deodorant is literally the best deodorant in the fucking world. I tell y'all, this is the only deodorant that works for me. Like, I swear by this deodorant. And this is not sponsored or anything. But, like, once I went and, like, transitioned over to spray deodorants, I just never went back. They're so easy to apply. And I feel like it lasts way longer than any other deodorant that i've ever tried so this this is a staple especially when you're working out you're in a gym like you want something lightweight but actually does the job you know and then i have my body hero lotion um you know just to stay moisturized because it's getting cold out and then i have my rose water and my hand cream because again cannot have no cracked hands and then i just have my lip gloss which doesn't fit in my skincare bag 
And then another thing I like to keep on deck are uh, hair clips, scrunchies, just depending on like my mood and what look I want to go for. Just keep my hair out of my face. Gotta have the headphones. I freaking love these headphones so much. Um, literally my babies. I freaking take these everywhere. I make sure they're charged, all that good stuff because... Who's trying to do a workout with no music? Like, let's be serious, you know? Another thing that I bring is a pair of shower shoes because I do shower at the gym. So basically, when I get up, like, I'll go to the gym with my workout clothes already on, but I'll always bring, like, an extra pair of clothes. Do I have them in there? Where are my extra clothes? I'll always bring, like, an extra pair of clothes underwear all that good stuff just to like change into when i'm after like done with my workout so a pair of shower shoes is really important like when you're trying to go in the sauna or go like in a jacuzzi or whatever you just want to like not have your feet on the fucking floor because you don't know what people got so i bring my lunch i pack my lunch well not my lunch really my breakfast so usually I go to the gym super early in the morning. I don't even eat breakfast before I go to the gym. Like I'll have like a pre-workout smoothie or something like that. And then I'll pack my breakfast with me. That way I can eat my breakfast after my workout. So I just pack my breakfast in my little lunchbox, whatever. And then I'll have that with me. Majority of the time it's like overnight oats or like something quick like that. And then I have my bagu bag. Um, this is what I put my dirty clothes in. Like when I finish working out, I put my dirty clothes in here. It's just easy, simple, quick. Like, and then it's like, I don't want my dirty clothes to like make my whole bag stink. So I just put them in here. And then, yeah, then when I get home, I, um, Take it out, put it in my laundry bag. Another thing is hydration. So I like to bring like a nice little water bottle. This one I probably won't be bringing to the actual gym just because I don't like that it doesn't have a cover. But this is the one that I use for the most part. Put water in here, pre-workout in here. Kind of just depends on what the vibe is. But I have like so many different types of freaking water bottles. It just kind of depends on what a vibe i'm going for if i'm trying to drink a lot a lot of water i'll go with this one simple water that's it but yeah definitely gotta keep a water bottle gotta stay hydrated during the workout sometimes i'll fill one up with like coconut water just depending on like what i need that day like if i need um excuse me if i need more electrolytes more hydration i'll do coconut water but you need a water bottle you need to stay hydrated during your workout so this one i don't really like to bring this one out as much because it's really heavy when i fill it up and it's like i i don't want to be hauling around like a huge bag to where it's like it's a workout just carrying the goddamn bag you know what i mean like no thing is hygiene products pads and stuff like that i used i had one i don't know where it went but i keep like an extra uh pad on me just in case um I need it and stuff like that. I actually need to re-up because I think I used my last one, if I'm being honest. So that's basically what's in the big pocket. And then on the side here, I keep stuff that I need to access quick. I have a charger, little brick in here. My wallet for easy access. I have my subway card, all that good stuff. And then lip gloss, or not lip gloss, but a uh, lip balm and gloss, stuff like that. Well, another thing is also having a nice gym shoe. So these are my Hoka's. I literally wear these all the freaking time. I'm freaking obsessed with them. But um, I also have my Nikes that I kind of like switch in between just depending on like what vibe i'm in but um the hokas are really comfortable i absolutely freaking love them and then i also have these hokas they're a little beat up but these do the trick they're really comfortable they do what they're supposed to so yeah i also wanted to just include that i got this new package in the mail from aura organics I'm super excited um it is my protein powder and my pre-workout that I ordered from them. It finally came. And just wanted to show y'all the packaging. I think it's really cute, really chic. But now that I'm going to like be getting back into the gym more, I wanted to just try some more natural 
ingredients and things like that because so I see a lot of people like using protein powders but sometimes they have like really bad ingredients so I wanted to give them a try so these are going to be the products that I'm using or trying out for like the next month or so and then um I'll probably do an updated video just to let you guys like know how the products have been working out yeah you guys that is the end of the video it was really just short quick to this to the point that I can't even speak. I just wanted to show y'all like what was in my bag. I do want to start filming more like gym content, but I'm still a newbie. And then I'd be kind of nervous like filming a gym because my gym be kind of a little iffy about that type of stuff. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, thank y'all for watching and yeah, I will see you on the next one.